Uh, I'm sorry guys, I forgot to have my microphone, I do apologize, I'm just practicing for my next video. Oh, oh yes, I should do a new video, I do apologize. Hi guys, what's up? Welcome to Mr. Wick channel once again. Here I am today in the beautiful town of Drytwich. I want to make you all feel welcome and today I want to discuss with you is about the very famous and popular vlogger, Supercar Blondie. Stay tuned. And there you go, guys. I do apologize. I was, I was just practicing. I'm trying to learn how to dance because I didn't know how to dance. Nevertheless, I want to make you feel all welcome. If you are new to my channel, thank you for coming here. Really appreciate that. What I would like to discuss with you guys, this is about Supercar Blondie. She's having a few problems like everybody perhaps have. You think she's rich, actually. She's a famous and very popular YouTuber who goes around the world. She's there. I'm still there, but one day, hopefully, I will get there. What I would like to share with you is uh, she posted uh, the, a last video, actually crying. She lost a dog, actually, almost three years ago, and she never grieved, actually. She was traveling so much that she never grieved, actually. L losing a dog was very precious uh, for her. I do love animals as well, so I would like you to know that as you know i've had even some animals on my channel i just want to share with you that we are humans even making videos for example i do work full time and i make youtube as my second job for the last two and a half years i haven't had no days off and no holidays and this is is not easy and obviously sooner or later it can break you can make you feel to go down nevertheless i'm still strong thanks thanks ever so much i have been struggling with the lockdown as well like perhaps some of you and i hope you are doing okay here i am in outside try to entertain you and i hope you do the same as well go out have some fresh air here i am in this beautiful town town of Droy Twitch Spa. As uh, you remember, I did a video a couple of weeks ago about this beautiful town. And uh, once again, let's go to the subject of uh, Supercar Blondie. So she said she came, became to a time she didn't have more contact with her family, with some of her close friends. And that is really sad because she put that work, YouTube in first place and money. She was making hundreds of thousands uh, of dollars and, uh, and obviously she put her family behind what is really really sad her priorities was to make videos as she started to make more money she needed to have more people actually to helping her out so she had she has i think eight or nine people helping her out i just got myself because i'm still small nevertheless i'm happy with that i'm not complaining um and obvious because she had to travel every two days she was traveled to a different country to make another video and obvious because she put uh, her work and she put YouTube in first place, making so much money and having so many people working for her that, for her, that it didn't help as well. And what I want to share with you is what is your priorities in life? She was struggling because she put YouTube, she left her family behind. And actually, if you notice, you watch her latest video, she been having actually new people on her videos. Actually, as a sister, she invited her sister to come because she was struggling. So now her sister and her sister's husband actually works for Supercar Blondie. And she invites even different people, making even different videos because with the lockdown it's been difficult. As I could see actually some of her videos lately, some of them was repetitive from uh, last year. It was the best cars of 2019 and 2020, etc. This is shows guys. We are not made out of steel, and it's hard. Obviously, she put YouTube in first place and forgot a family, a close friends. So that is very important in our lives. Whatever you do in your life, you do need to see what is the main, what is your main focus and your main goal in life. And perhaps we can, we can, uh, we can balance too. We can have a relationship with our family, and we can have a relationship with YouTube or making videos. Obviously, everybody is different. She paid the price because travel all the time, every two days, going around the world making uh, videos did affect her. She didn't think she was. She didn't think she was left her friends and family behind. That is very important. So we do need to see what is 
uh, our priorities in life. Another thing that I, I can see some big and famous and popular YouTubers, they do, and this could happen actually around the world, this is after they become famous or, or they have uh, uh, millions of subscribers, as I have met several. Actually, I do know someone who did, who did meta and she wasn't very nice, she wasn't even friendly. I found that very sad because I do like to speak with people. I like to say hi or I take photos, you name it. I do talk with people. And I can promise you guys that is something I will never do. But it's something that I will never do as well is just put my channel in first place and I forget about to have a holidays or a good time. And yes, the last two and a half years actually has been very difficult. Thank God I don't have to travel uh, around the world and I don't have nine people working for me. So yes guys, it is really difficult actually to be a YouTuber and to make videos for YouTube. It's not for everyone, I have to say, and it's not easy as well. Uh, what I want to tell you guys is um, it's hard and very difficult for us. Obviously, with this situation of the lockdown, actually it's been quite difficult for me, as I reckon it's been for you. I used to go out and do shows and go so many cities and towns. By the way, if you see me one day, you can approach me. I'll be friendly. I'll say hi to you, we can have a chat and even take a photo, even if I'm making a, a video. See, I do like animals. Hello, hello you, you're so cute. Isn't that beautiful, guys? Sorry about that. Uh, all right. Like I said, it's been uh, difficult. It's been very difficult for me as well with this situation, with three lockdowns and other things, restrictions. As I start actually to make the videos, I had even the, 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 the police harassing me, coming after me actually side by side. This was in Cheltenham. It was really difficult. I didn't put that in the video, but you don't know what we're going through, isn't it? And uh, we try not to show that to yourselves, but uh, we are not made of steel. We can feel weak as well. We can feel low. We can even cry and not sleep. So being a YouTuber is very, very difficult, obvious. I need to balance as my life is, and you know, it's just not about YouTube and I forget other things. Actually, I do work, if you want to know, and I do work full time. So I finish at 12 o'clock on Friday and there you go. Here I am making a, another video and tomorrow and the day after as well. I do enjoy, I do have to say for now, I do really enjoy. I try to make so many different subjects so we can be appealing to so many different people as I got actually subscribers from three years old to 90 years old. I do have youngsters from old ones. And so I'm trying to please everyone, but I do please myself because I do like what I do. So I hope you are all okay. Thanks for watching once again. Here I am with this beautiful Dex21. How friendly they are, so close to me. Look at him, or oh, look at her, wow. Normally they're, ve they're very shy, these type of animals, I can tell you. So for a duck to be so close, you must be thinking, I got food, let's see if you'll come close. Or closer. She's the female and the male is just behind her. Can you see? Wow, how brave she is, she's quite close. Can you see, guys? But she's not brave to come to my hand. And look at that, the male. Wow, how brave. Oh, I just love all the animals. And look at this beautiful place that I am, guys. So I'm very grateful that you watch my videos. And I hope that you are all okay. Thanks for watching once again. And here I am. Today's video was about this very popular and famous YouTuber. That shows that we are humans and we have weakness and we have strengths. And all of us have. It's just we try to hide. Unfortunately, she put YouTube just in number one where she forgot her clothes, friends, and her own family. And now, thank God, I think she made the best decision of her life to work with her sister and her husband. So I hope you are all okay. Thanks for watching, guys. I really appreciate it. And here I am in this beautiful day, 20 degrees, and it's absolutely incredible and very good. Oh my goodness. Soon, the summer will be here, and soon, all of this will be gone. I do hope, because I, I'm a little concerned that they're going to come with another um, story to lock us down or to stop us going out because the British public does respond very quickly. As you can see, I came on a motorway, oh my goodness, and it was full of people. People, they are just traveling, people, they just want to go out, people just want to eat and drink or even go to the cinema or even at a theme park or maybe you. You want to go to a, 
a, a theater. I do want to go as well. So I hope you are all okay. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you on the next one.